Hi Scorpio, welcome. If you're new here, you are very welcome here. If you are returning, welcome back. I hope you're all doing well. I hope you got your coffee, snacks, cappuccino. I need you guys to hit that like and subscribe button. I am coming on almost a year now and I have almost made it to 2000. Thank you, thank you, thank you everybody who already has. I love you guys. Um, it is the eve of new year. 2023 has been the hardest year of my life so far, but it has been one of the most rewarding as well. Probably the most important in lessons for sure. Um, as many of you guys already know, I, this time last year, I lost everything, my home, my land, my property, everything inside of it, and my child and I all of a sudden had nothing. Um, so we had to rebuild, and that's exactly what I'm in the middle of doing, but this, so this year, a year later, is a huge memorial, but it's also the beginning of, like, this coming month is one, two, three, like, exactly it's a month of acceleration it's gonna be really freaking crazy but i'm like really blessed to even say that it's possible i have quite a few people that are close to me that are like surprised that i made it out alive after some of the stuff that's happened to my health but hey here i am there's a reason right spirit help me get clear and precise messages for my viewers archangel michael the rest of my team angels ancestors guides Continue to show up, block any interferences, block any negativity, return it to sender or where it belongs. Thank you. All right. Aquarius could be playing a huge role in your life right now. Could be dealing with one thinking about one, have one on your way, or you could have Aquarius highly aspected. This is a free general read. If you need a personal reading, that information is always in the description box below, as well as my PayPal link. I already split these and check this out. I can't make it up if I wanted to. At the front of the deck, we have peace, and at the back, we have love. The two things that you've probably been praying most for are coming in. Scorpio, congratulations. Um, you could be in a new kind of relationship. You could have a completely new outlook on what peace really is and what love really means. Uh, this year could have been a really hard lesson in exactly who's going to, you know, the type of person you are versus the type of person that other people may be. Uh, how much you're willing to give versus how much other people are willing to give. Your way of living, loving, and having peace versus other people's ways of living, loving, and having peace or lacking it. And these are, unfortunately, huge, huge life lessons. You could also be learning a lot of lessons in gluttony, greed, envy, and jealousy. But now that you know what they look like, you can learn when, when to avoid them. Okay, it is it it's your birthright to have peace. It's you're entitled to peace, and it is your you have a lot of fate and destiny that was showing up from my previous reads, and it's boom right here, right now. Whatever starts to fall away in 2024, the year of number eight, let it. Let it die peacefully. You could also be more confident and understanding about walking in your fate, walking in your purpose, walking in your destiny, walking toward your fate and destiny. I'm going to leave that right there. It's beautiful energy to open up with. Um, let's get into this. If I didn't already say it, you guys effing rock. You're the effing shit. This is the last day that I'm going to use probably words like that. <laughs> um, don't let anyone tell you any different. Don't you know? Yeah, so a lot of Aquarius energy. Okay, so something could be very uh, important about the end of January to February season. Wow, this is pretty freaking strong, Scorp, already. 
So, it tells me a lot about your power. All this communication and intuition. There could be a lot of Aquarius people in your energy meeting their fate, meeting their destiny. It says confirmation. Wow. All right. And I just want to say some some people <clears throat> some people may not be meant. It may not be people's meant fate. It may not be their purpose to be there for others during difficult times. Because you're born ruling death and birth. It's kind of part of your purpose to help others during their hardest time. So you could probably have caught yourself um, lending hands to people who are going through their worst. Or, you know, you kind of just find yourself being a shoulder to cry on for people who are having the worst times. And you kind of find comfort in giving comfort. You know what I'm saying? Where, whereas other people aren't meant to be there for others during those same deaths and rebirths, okay? Um, I wouldn't hold it against everyone, but it is a lesson. It's an eye-opener, you know? I don't know why. I'm just kind of, like, feeling like, you know, somebody like, I've been there. I've, I've been there for so many people. Why would I ever have to sit alone? Because that's just the way it is. Yeah, that's just how, how it works. That's how people work. You have the arrow focus. You could also be dealing with the Sagittarius. And you may be the type of, yeah, you're for sure the type of person to kind of like isolate yourself and then be like, oh, I'm so alone, but you're not. Right underneath fate and destiny, uh, you, it says do not, uh, do not trust. There's candle with illumination and water. So something about you and a, a fire, fire sign, possibly foresight. You don't trust a lot of people. Somebody may have a north node in Aquarius, so it may be kind of part of your fate to learn how to detach, as as irky as that may sound. Okay. Oh, what's going on here? Wow. We have the fortune cookie. Fortuous. Fate, focus, fortuous. We could be getting into numerology as well. Paying closer attention. And foresight, again, the, the three powerful Fs. Focus, fortuous, and foresight. So you could be manifesting a lot, or you're seeing a lot of your manifestations coming through. You're giving a lot of messages and getting a lot of messages. A lot of communication energy is coming in. Well, okay. Direction. So there's some kind of path. This is also saying... Where it, whichever way you're focused, there's arrows going that way, there's footprints going that way. Here, here lies fortune. There's a lot of, like, beauty. Yeah, lots and chance. What's this have to do with? Let's get one for the overall energy. 
Okay, here we go again in the upright. <laughs> Bro. Okay, so um, yeah, you're getting a lot of communication and this may not be from people. And if it is, they may be from another uh, realm. The shooting star and feathers. This is freaking gorgeous. Uh, um, what a beautiful New Year's, New Year treat. Messages and confirmation. <laughs> I love you guys. Change. Ching. Cha-ching. All right. <clears throat> That's freaking sickening. Some of you guys may be great hunters as well. Some of y'all may hunt with bow and arrow. Somebody may hunt like duck, wild turkey or something. Somebody definitely hunts birds. Somebody has a bird dog. Okay. The signs for Scorpio with signs coming in. 1101 again. <clears throat> Libra and fire. Aries, Leo, Sag, and Libra. Some of you guys could be in like a new phase with a Libra. I mean, to each their own. I did it a Libra one time, and I just don't know if I could do that again. I got a little crazy, but y'all, y'all might, you might, you might, or you have Libra in your chart, or, or uh, there's a Libra focused on you. Who's coming in? What's going on? Cancer. One more. Water. Cancer Pisces Scorpio. Bottom of the deck we have Sun, Uranus, Taurus. Is that more Aquarian energy? Leo. Back of the deck Virgo, Mercury, and Sagittarius. Mercury heads direct January, I believe. I know for like a week there, I was feeling so out of it. You could be kind of focused on love. You, one, two, two, two. You're like running into somebody or somebody is headed your way. Um, that you, you, you love this person. Or you're like open to falling in love. It might be a lust-based connection at first, but. <clears throat> so be paying attention. When you see stars certain stars any kind of stars you may be like me and take your telescope and just stare at the stars on the moon every freaking night <clears throat> pay attention you may end up seeing a shooting star this winter or this summer something about july to september could be very significant pay attention when you see feathers especially black or white someone may see a blue um arrows messages coming through like crazy because these are like life-changing messages and footprints footprints and handprints this is literally what it feels like to be aligned aligned arrow and direction damn ptsd Yeah, you could have dealt with a, a terrible situation in the past, in the past, that was traumatic, stressful, disorderly. <clears throat> you could have been through all kind of shit, just falling apart. You know, um, let let the tower fall, as it may. Yeah, cause you don't even know. Virgo popping out a lot. All right, what is focus for Scorpio? <clears throat> you may be understanding as well that what you're what you're putting your thoughts into, it's coming. There is an Aquarius somewhere. Snap. That uh is really freaking focused on you. This person could be low vibe. 
doing really low shit, reaping what's been sown and court. So there could also, okay, on one end of the spectrum, you could be dealing with multiple Aquariuses as well. Maybe you don't, or they just have Aquarius in their truck. Multiple people here. There's one that's a bad one, and they have summoned some shit up. They've done some really not so good stuff, so they're going to have to answer for that. There's another one that, they're not bad, but they have been in hell for a while, and they've been just like accepting of these kinds of people. So this is what is being done about that. And they may be having to deal with that as well. It's like one is bringing a demon up and one is putting a demon down. They could have different moon placements. I don't know who that's for. Lust. Somebody has hyper freaking focused on you. Woo wee. Yeah, so a lot of, a lot of karma, karmic energy going, going around. Let's focus. Uh. Can you focus, baby? Yeah, you're focused on fucking the goods. Yep, boss. Very powerful. Definitely feels like your own energy, but you could also be, uh, someone hates on your spirituality, oh yeah, but you could also be, this doesn't have to be a person, this could be an institution that you could be taking a stand or something. Okay, what's four choice? Winning. This doesn't have to be you. Like I said, it can be somebody from your past and someone from your future. <clears throat> Learning that the devil has beauty as well, so that you can learn what to... Hmm. Somebody is also trying to do what you do, but it's a... Uh, what do they call it? Bootleg. Pirated. <laughs> but who fucking cares, right? You're not even... whatever. It's footprints. Direction footprints. Oh, you got burnt out again. We're not. We're we're gonna put that back. But because I know, I know you are. But someone here with the footprints and the feathers. For one, you're leaving your freaking mark, and for two, you're studying or seeing God's prints, learning God's language. I was watching, I don't know why I'm, but I'm going to share this with you guys, but, um, I was watching, cause I'm a freaking mess right now. So what? Um, I was watching a white blood, I was watching this dude, he put a, there was a germ in his blood and I was watching the white blood cells fight the germ. I cried. Just a little bit because I was just telling you guys about how, I know I really broke down the other day, sorry about that, but I was saying like how life is just a fight. It just seems like life is just a constant fight, but yes, yeah, it is. There's a time for you to put your weapons down, but for the most part, life is a battlefield, like, and, and That's just the cycle of it. That's just the circle of it. And you can fight this life with dignity. <clears throat> or you can fight it dirty. You know? Alright. Let's get one for direction. 
somebody is still big mad at you and I don't think you give one fuck. Yeah, that was their stupid moves, their stupid decisions, and their stupid behavior. Let's get one. Okay, from twinning to winning. And learning what the true definition of victory really is. Now you got someone's baby mama trying to blame their life on you. And that ain't your fault either. Yeah, because here we are. Big Mad still sticking out. Baby mom liar and gold digger. Ooh, she's a gold digger. Just know she's a gold digger. Change in my pocket wasn't enough. I'm like, F you. F her too. <laughs> Oh man, these people are fucking miserable. Oh yeah, they are. And they hate you for it, and it ain't, ain't got nothing to do with you. You know better. So, see how I said, uh, you know, you, you, you're focused, and you're on your path, you're on your direction, you've beaten all the fucking odds, and you've had a lot of people against you. This is like friends, family, lovers. You've had a lot of people sent your way just to sucker punch you while you're on your path. Sometimes you deserved it, and sometimes you really didn't. You don't know, like, you know, but there's people from your past wanting to put this image off, but it's bootleg. Winning, twinning, you know. You could also be coming into alignment illegal in jail. What the fuck's going on here? Somebody may be getting locked up or on their way to being locked up. Maybe it looks... Didn't I say, dude? Um... It's like they want it to look... Somebody wants something to look a certain way on the outside. Man, this is like a freaking clout. This is what clout is. I never thought I would even be in a position to even be talking about clout. But that's dead ass what this is. A fucking clout hungry person. They do everything for the gram. They do everything for the public. They want... But it's a fucking facade. So they're, they're mad you won't fake it, I guess. And whoever they're faking it toward is mad that they're being faked out. Oh my god, yeah. Okay, anyway. Messages. Let's get one for messages. Boom. Can't change it. Nobody can. Yeah, someone's addicted to drama and the chaser runner bullshit and you're like, bitch... I got out of that in second grade. Oh lord. Somebody... <clears throat> somebody may be going through uh, everything that you went through in the past. <sighs> Messages, feathers, spirit. I think that's going to be your thumbnail. beautiful. Don't you know that you are a shooting star? Some of y'all may be getting a new car. Your focus is also shifting from like what the problem is to what the solution can be. Very good. Very good for you. ones do i want to use these or do i want to use these i'll use these first <laughs> oh lord I'm sorry, it's just somebody does something for such, like, uh, uh, surface level shit. That's why you ghosted that shit. Go ahead. Go ahead. Keep, keep, keep going. Keep jumping. So you walk, you walking away from that. You need, you need people around you who are certain because, like your previous read show, you are positive in every way. You are certain to four, four, four. You can't build with someone that takes shortcuts, duct tapes, and isn't certain. You can't. 
What is coming in for Scorpio 2024? <laughs> Ew. And anything that brings you. Oh Lord. Somebody somebody has some kind of like a, oh my goodness. Okay. For some specific people out there, you already know what this mess is and you're you yeah. You go right ahead, blueface. You go right ahead. Scorpio, but it's good that you're kind of like learning to just like laugh and excel. It's like pawn shop victories, pawn shop gestures, pirated movie date. <laughs> Which is okay if the intention is pure, but if it's bootleg and the intention isn't pure, what the fuck are you doing there? Alright, what's well, coming in for Scorpio? Now I have that focus song stuck in my head. I don't, I don't know who that is. Baby, can you focus on me? wedding in the reverse someone's going through a big deal don't mean dallas i can't believe what the world had to tell us he got a ring she wanted the palace someone's going through the big d don't mean dallas i don't know the real words but it's a facade there's a hidden meaning behind it it's full of disguise and deception and lies, and you don't give not one fuck. This is also you breaking away from... Maybe it's a bootleg twin. Maybe you thought this person was your twin because they, like, copy off you, they dress like you, they act like you, they take what you say and try to use it, and you're like, uh-uh, that can't be right. Something don't feel right, man. Something don't feel right. Yeah. Alright. Who's coming in? This one's coming in. So you kind of like come off as mysterious. You know what I'm saying? Because you're a freaking Scorpio. But somebody else wants to come off as mysterious. But they come off as just like a creep. An actual freaking creep. And it's and it's a it's a disguised creep at that. You know what I'm saying? Like, oh, you're trying to be mysterious and sexy, but you're actually coming off as a sh as a liar. Um, that's not cute. Yeah, exactly. Opposite. What's coming in with winning for Scorpio? Oh, somebody's also like angry or jealous of your accomplishments, your achievement. This person can't hang anyway, Scorpio, because you get a lot of attention. Not that you're even focused on that, but this clout-hungry person is. So they're like competing with, you know, the recognition that you're getting, the, the, the achievement. Dude, this person's watched you on your whole path. This person has focused on you. They've been watching you on your whole path. This is the type of person maybe like anytime you moved, they showed up. If you were pregnant, they showed up. If you got a new job, they showed up. How the fuck does this person even know where the fuck you're working? You know what I'm saying? <laughs> oh Lord. So somebody, somebody is clinging and bribing and Mm. Not clinging onto you, clinging onto what they think would be a, a bandage. Okay, all right. I 
can't believe what the world had to tell. I don't even know what those words are, but storm one and scorp scorp. This person could have also seen that you're maybe in a new. Yep, that's exactly what they did. They seen that you were in, or they they make assumptions based off of bits and pieces of what you say, and then they try to replicate it. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. That ain't good. That ain't fun. Alright, what's the messages? Messages, messages, messages. Also, um, somebody may try to come up and ruffle your feathers uh, in your new, you know, relationship. This new, this new adventure that you're on. Crossroads, reconciliation, and family anxiety versus intuition. That's what it's there for, baby. Use it. I'm going to draw the rest of these in silence real quick and then catch your own tarot. But I want you all to see that I don't I don't just pull cards and set them out there. I want you all to see. Because some people do do that, you know what I'm saying? And I wouldn't be totally real if I didn't tell some of you guys... Stop watching every fucking tarot channel you see. Stop watching every tarot reader you see. Okay. Like I was saying, there's a lot of do it for the grand people out there. and Just, just, just don't. Promise. <laughs> mean girls. And it ain't just Scorpios. Uh, uh, every fixed sign can get fixated on that shit. Chill out. Man, because I be seeing some stuff and I'm just like, that is so far from the fucking truth. Why did you even upload that? You know what I'm saying? Just like, man, feel your own vibe. Yeah, exactly. All right. Somebody could have also told somebody that they're going to like relocate or something like that. And instead of them letting things die peacefully they chase they're like addicted to it but it, it's a very unhealthy chase instead of a healthy white blood cell fight off germs to have the body you know okay if that didn't make sense i'm sorry travel Towards illness. Courthouse. You've made a lot of decisions to walk away from a lot of shit. Yep. Player. It's wedding in the reverse. Wealthy man in reverse. You already know what's up. Mystery. Somebody hates your footprints. It's like your your imprint that you leave someone. Someone's mad about it. But they don't want to admit that every uh they don't want to admit that every move that's made is made off of that manifestation in reverse. Crew. 
Ooh wee, ain't that careful what you wish for, Scorp. Learn that lesson. Proposal. <laughs> okay, somebody. Uh, it's just so not right with winning and proposal right there with your footprints. Like, oh man. Okay. Proposal. This is manipulation at its finest. Damn. Sweetheart upright. Storm warning. Thief. Tell you once, I'll tell you twice. Come with me. Like a thief in the night. See how come crossroads. Yes, crossroads. Expectation. Reconciliation. Good news, divine support, occupation, direction again, half truths, success and love, family, mature woman, So you know that someone's decisions are leading to dark places. Anxiety and sad news, we will check up on those two as well and see what that is about. But that is what I have for the oracles. I will catch y'all in the tarot. Bye!